March 10th. Jackie, I've always just been fascinated by rock climbing, like people's strength and being able to, like, it's it's totally fascinating to me. Yeah, it is. I mean, you think you can do it. You think you can get to the top. And then Until you actually have to do it, and you're like, mm. Yeah, yeah. You're like, maybe I should just leave it to the pros, you know? <laughs> really gave it a good try. All right, well, we're going to let you, the pro on weather, tell us how we're shaping up today. Yeah, I'll give it a good try. Let's talk about <laughs> the weather out there this morning. A few spotty sprinkles are with us. Those are quickly fading away. Still some areas of patchy fog though this morning. You may encounter that mainly north and west of the I-81 corridor. We will see some sunshine developing later on this afternoon. Already noticing some of those clouds breaking apart over here in Georgetown just outside of our studio. Drier with more sun though as we get towards Friday. So Friday all dry. It's late Friday night and then into Saturday more rain is on the way. So it will be a soggy start to this upcoming weekend. I would say Saturday, get those indoor plans ready. I would say maybe spring cleaning would be something that you could do on Saturday. Also, maybe the movies or catching up on one of your favorite shows or reading a book. I do need to get started on my New Year's resolution of reading more books this year. So I know I need to start it. I need to start. I think Saturday will be the day. Radar out there this morning. Like I mentioned, any of those rain showers, those are quickly fading away. Any little drizzle is mainly back Back over where we're seeing a little of that fog still looming. That low pressure continue to move its way off towards southern New England. Back here locally, we are drying things out after all that rain that we did see yesterday and even a little bit into early this morning. Visibility, it is low still. Frederick, Manassas, as well as Luray and Kaiser still down about a mile of visibility in all those areas I just listed. This is where we could also see a little bit of that mist and a little bit of that drizzle too. Eventually that fog will lift out over the next couple of hours. Temperatures right now, another mild start. We're into the upper 40s to low to mid 50s across the region. We'll eventually notice those high temperatures climb back into those lower 60s. So if you're trying to plan out the rest of your day today, again, we'll still see more clouds and sunshine by about 11 a.m., but we should be seeing some more sunny breaks developing by the middle of the afternoon. Those high temperatures will climb, though, low to mid 60s. Those middle 60s that you see on the map, that's likely where we do see that sunshine emerging a little bit earlier compared to farther east, where those clouds will linger uh, a little bit uh, later than what we see back out towards the west. Lows tonight, this will be colder than the last several nights nights that we've had. We'll see those overnight lows falling back in the upper 30s to lower 40s, and that will be what we start off with tomorrow morning. So heads up, won't be quite as mild as what we're seeing out there this morning for tomorrow morning. Then we bounce back in those upper 50s to lower 60s for your Friday afternoon. And like I mentioned, dry conditions for your Friday. It's late Friday night that we do have this system approaching. That could throw some showers back out towards some of our western zones. Those rain showers will be widely scattered across our area for your Saturday. Then as we get towards Sunday, Sunday morning at least, could see a little bit of that rain switching over to some snow showers back over towards the Alleghenies and those uh, the mountains region. So heads up for those higher elevations back out towards our west. That's where we could see a little bit of that changeover. Aside from that, most of the area should be dry on Sunday, but it will be cooler both weekend days. High temperatures back into the lower 50s, and then we bounce back into those low to mid 50s Monday. will be breezy that day, but dry as we get towards next Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures moderating back into those lower 60s Tuesday, mid to upper 60s Wednesday. So a gradual warming trend through the middle of that next work week with that sunshine. Shanika, how are those roadways this morning?